It was but really like, instead bad. of being like, hey, you know, we're bringing in some extra people to maybe help out with the concept of it, you know, just being like, no, you're fucking fired, go find a new job. That might, it's like, man, we worked on this for like three years, and you know, we're really proud of this shit, and they're like, Halo 4 was like, Halo 4 was like, okay, we're gonna try and take this in a new direction, we're gonna be ambitious, we're gonna do this, and you could see, they actually were trying. Halo 5 was like, hey, yeah, uh, fuck all these characters we established, here's new ones that you have to like right now that you're gonna play for 85% of the game. Also, the one that you actually like playing as is a war criminal for whatever fucking reason. Um, yeah, have fun. Also, he lost to the guy that we just introduced this game. Yeah, from so, what I remember, like, the, te the team that made Halo 4's, uh, co-op multiplayer story, Spartan those were the guy- <laughs> Yeah, Spartan Ops. Those guys got moved up pretty much like, hey, by the way, you're now in charge of the game, bye, because, like, half of 343's guys, who, like, the top people in Halo 4 left and went to go to other <laughs> shit, which is kind of a common practice, you know? You do one game and it's like, you know, I'm cool, I want to go work on something else. Or somebody else Fair. wants me to work on something. So they basically took the guys who were like, hey, come up with a multiplayer story that you guys have some ideas for. Okay, cool, now you're the lead writers for Halo. It's like, oh, fuck. They're the ones that are doing Infinite, or? No, who did five. Oh, they did. They went from. What the they, fuck? They went from. Hey, that makes side no goddamn sense. The fucking side story was actually that was actually like one of the best parts of Halo 4. Because but they went it was from actually so well written. Hey, write a side story to okay, cool. <laughs> now you're in charge of the entire franchise direction. And, okay, here's my fucking if they were the guys that were fucking in charge of Halo 5 and they had to like, and they, I don't know, they had to have some directive where, oh, you need to have another team to play us alongside Blue Team or what the fuck ever. They had a team already. They had Fire Team fucking Majestic that was already established and that people already fucking liked. Who the fuck is like? The only person people liked from Osiris was Buck. And that's because he was a fucking ODST beforehand. We actually knew him. Nobody liked anybody from Osiris. N not one person. <laughs> I still have never played Halo like, 5. Locke, Locke was so badly written, he ended up getting killed off in a comic because everybody fucking hated him. Like, yeah. That's literally what happened in after Halo 5 is fucking Locke just got killed off in a fucking comic. Finally! You did it! <coughs> hey! Oh, insert Ninth Symphony hurt. music here. Jesus. <laughs> Impressive. The result won't be the same next time. Until then, Colonel. I may have gotten my ass kicked, but the next time I'll kick your ass. <laughs> <laughs> These two boss fights are no joke. Fuck, dude. I used to be that better makes at this no game. Sense that, like, how the fuck does somebody that went from Halo Four with like one of the most well-designed story elements of Halo 4 go around and completely botch Halo 5 like that. That makes no goddamn sense to me. I mean, Ow. there is defi definitely different expectations from, hey, make a, fun make a fun little multiplayer side story to, okay, now you're the next mainline Halo writer. I'm trying to remember. But still, they were very faithful to the lore when they were doing the side story. They're like, okay, this, this like, okay, here's Dr. Halsey. This is what she's doing. She's a lore criminal now because she kidnapped a whole bunch of children and turned them into super soldiers. All right, fair enough. Now she's being brought on to fucking do some research on these Forerunner artifacts. All right, makes fucking sense. And now it's Halo 5's like, all right, there's these new four schmucks that you've never heard of except for Buck, and uh, they're going to replace Master Chief. Like, ah, oh, damn it! There was a heart piece. There. <laughs> oh. Then there was a jump there. Yeah, um, I should have a chance this time. It, it, is this bringing back uh, some Battle Toads memories? I was about to say this is just fucking looks <laughs> like Battle Toads. Yeah, I, would, I wasn't Toads thinking that, but now that you race. mention it, hey, hey, do you have Battle Toads no. for the Nintendo Wii? For the new you know, it's funny, because there actually was a new Battletoads that got released. There was! And I was like, oh, and then it just, they like, finally won. Really and then people stopped playing. And then it yeah. immediately went to Obscurity, like, five days later. Because it wasn't Which, like, good. it looks oh, cool. Fuck, I like the man. design. I like the style of it. 
it well, looked that very gone stylistic, better. but it didn't really look like it looked kind of like honestly, it was kind of like Mario Party, where it was like a bunch of really zany mini games that you played as the Battle Toads, oh. rather than like actual beat 'em up shit, from what I could see. Listen, I just want to pre-order Battle Toads for the Ooh. Nintendo Ooh. Wii. Listen, no, 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 all, no. all we need, all we need, is just a, a serious Battle Toads game. Didn't it's the... a Battletoads game where they try to pre-order Battletoads. Shit. How was that recent, like, remake of Battletoads? I heard it was, like, mediocre. That's, that's what we were talking pretty, about? That's pretty much what I heard, and also, yeah, we were literally just talking about it, so... Oh, okay, sorry, I was... Yeah. It seems to no, be it's a all good. common theme with you. We're all just zoning out. <laughs> Speak for yourself, I'm paying attention. <laughs> Asshole. Yo, we're playing Wave Race?! Oh fuck, <laughs> we're playing the goddamn Wave Race on the fucking GameCube? Uh, I, I was gonna go to the Nintendo race. 64. Uh, I played Blue Nintendo Storm 64. on the GameCube. I didn't have a GameCube. I was not even- I was one when the GameCube was released. I didn't have a GameCube until I was like, I wanna say at least 14 or 15. Like, I, I was practically old enough to drive by the time I actually got a fucking GameCube. Oh, fuck. My mom got me a GameCube, and the first game I played on was like, what was it, oh, Mario no. Party 6 ah, or fuck. 7, I forget which. The first game that I played on GameCube was Lord of the Rings The Return of the King. Because there there were two games that we had for that GameCube when we <laughs> first got it. Uh, it was Lord of the Rings and... Fucking Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban, I think. I we tried also got the two towers later on. I heard Return of the King was actually a decent game. It's it's. I mean, I had fun with it. I played the shit out of that game. Like I played it all the way to completion, unlocked all the cheat codes and all the fucking oh, extra characters and shit. He fucking you boosted uh, the wall. Trolled me. You ass white. You you ran into the wall. <laughs> yeah, as soon as yeah, I you did. Yeah, as soon as I hit him, all of a sudden there's a fucking wall right there. It's like, ha! If you try to catch me right there, I'm gonna fucking corner you and you're gonna die. He set me up. My first like GameCube how, game like was not having a GameCube. The what? I said my first GameCube game was not having a GameCube. My first GameCube game was also not <coughs> having a GameCube game. In that case, like the fuck. Whoa! Yeah. I remember. I, I remember like fucking pre-ordering Wind Waker and getting that. Ex and Whoop. remember how they had that deal where if you pre-ordered Wind Waker, you got like the fucking remakes of Ocarina of Time on oh, GameCube yeah, yeah, and shit. Yeah. yeah, and the master. By the way, I'm I'm so pissed off that the Ocarina of Time Majora's Mask oh. remakes only came out on 3DS. Yeah. Dude, I think yeah. They that was a fucking those fucking waste. They seriously need to bring the them to Switch. Weren't the DS's the like, yeah, answer to a not portable the Switch? N64? The 3DS was a little bit more powerful than the N64, but not, not by, by much. much. Yeah. Yeah. It could run, like, a GameCube <coughs> game or two, but what it was... It could was... run a prettier version of a Ocarina of Time, but at the same time, we had the Switch, and we had fucking Breath of the Wild and shit, and we could see what a Zelda <coughs> game on the Switch could be like. I like, just... And we got it on 3DS! I like, just I don't understand Nintendo. You have all these IPs, all these games in your library, I, and I you don't really... port them to the Switch. Alright, I think I know what it is. Uh, it's that Nintendo is run by a bunch of fucking old dudes now. Uh, basically, after fucking Reggie left, uh, their, their sense of youth kind of just disappeared because Doug Bowser's like, what, in his 60s? He's like 68? Some I think like that Doug that. Bowser might be younger than Reggie Fisame. How the fuck is he younger? He's got Hold gray up. hair. Reggie, me, Reggie's so goddamn he's he's so useful. Let me look this up. Let me look this up. Is uh, Doug Bowser feels so much older than Reggie? Okay, Here's Doug Bowser is fifty-five, and, and Reggie is and Reggie well, Fisame is sixty off. years old. He's now? five years old. Reggie is five years older than Doug Bowser. What the fuck? <laughs> How the fuck does Reggie know this shit better than y'all then, the fuck? Uh, you got more youthful and yeah. blood and you're still fucking it up. Yeah. God damn it, Reggie just shouldn't have left. Reggie was- before Reggie left, everything was mostly right with Nintendo.
Everything was right. right in the world, like, and then he the left. that Reggie fucking left, like, all the dumbass dis business decisions that fucking Nintendo started making recently, like, especially with all the fucking YouTube shit, is just- it's No, 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 no. up to 11. I'm, I'm gonna call it's... bullshit on that one, because that was mm -hmm. going on, like, in 2016. Yeah, remember when they started yeah, that whole I'm partner program and shit? But I'm saying it's gotten only worse ever since he left. Like, it's oh. gotten, like, twice as bad. Well, the problem is the Japanese division, which doesn't yeah. understand, like, fucking copyright the same way as the, like, U.S. I mean, Angry Joe dealt with this. He was talking to representatives from Capcom of America, and they basically told him, Hey, it's not us, it's the Japanese division, because they're very old-fashioned and don't understand how this useful this actually is to us. Yeah. Like, yeah. Bug Bowser has a couple things, but, like, you know... No, I haven't it's heard not... from Doug Bowser ever since he was ever since he replaced Reggie. Like I heard like Reggie doing shit all the time when he was employed, and then ever since he got replaced by Doug Bowser, I just I haven't heard Doug Bowser at all. Yeah, it's I not like oh Reggie was here and times was good and now he he's gone and all things are bad. Like there was a lot of bad shit during Reggie's years. <laughs> I mean, yes. Like, I think the 2017, 2018, like, Reggie's last two <coughs> years were too fucking good. Like, two very good years back to back. So everyone's like, oh yeah, his entire tenure was like that. He was the Wii U guy. <laughs> yeah. God here, damn. Here was the thing about the Wii U that I actually ended up admiring Nintendo for, which is when it fucking colossally flopped, uh, nobody ended up getting fired for it. It was just like, alright, yeah, that's on us, we designed it, listen. Fucking yeah, well, no, no, yeah, no, Iwata. Yeah, Iwata took a fucking pay cut in order to keep the staff on, in order to keep morale up, basically. Yeah. Yeah. It's like Iwata's getting paid, like he's getting CEO money. He can take a pay cut for a year. It's not yeah. gonna yeah. fucking. It's not gonna. And like you don't see that with pretty much <laughs> any other fucking CEO or like suit leadership position. No, anymore. they they it's fire like, a shitload of people and then give themselves bonuses. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You see it with Blizzard, you see it with fucking Bethesda, at least before they got bought up by Microsoft. I have no God, idea what's going on with them now. See it with Activision, yeah. So took care of him. Jesus. Like Ew, what a man. Rest in peace. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah, one Nintendo of these days, I'll buy a Wii U. I was... about that for a while. Also, so, yeah. Yeah, so Dragon just defeated you. R strong X. No fucking shit. Such a waste. Why, Dragoon? I always wanted to fight you. Then he appeared. He appeared who? He told me to work for the Rebel Force. To goad you into fighting. You did it just so that you could fight me? It was worth it, was worth it for the final duel. Yeah, and nearly costing the Rebel Force their extinction. Their fucking last straw. <laughs> and he blew up. Yeah. Boom. And he just fucking leaves. <laughs> I have rising fire. I... Very nice. I still remember the big fucking smile on my face I had when was it? I think it was E3 2015 when they had Iwata, Reggie, and Miyamoto all Muppets. That was really <laughs> funny. Yeah, it was pretty good. Oh. By the way, guys, the like, no donations. Like, do you not want me to mix the drinks? Yeah, I mean, no, I'm if... kind of surprised that nobody's nobody's tried to make him spin the wheel yet. That is surprising. <laughs> and I mean, you know this time we can say we can save it for another week. Yeah, I think it's also because it like, this week, honestly, yes, Galaxy. You know what it is? Now that I mentioned it, now that you guys mean, or now that I've realized it. What? They, they, they saw, they saw what happened the last stream, and they probably did not want you to get hurt. <laughs> what happened last After stream? The fuck happened last stream? I raped I with here. Metroid, um, La Zero Mission. Did oh, you had a Metroid. Beat Metroid Zero Mission yet? I'm sorry. Did you beat Metroid Zero Mission yet? No, I was stuck at that part where they're um, Dude, like, the I'm in the. Why the fuck are you playing Mega Man X? He rage quit. Did you miss that part of the sentence? <laughs> yeah, I know. Why aren't you playing Metroid Zero Mission and finishing it now? <laughs> he had a week to cool off. The fuck? Because I want to. Listen, take a break he got Metroided. Yeah, I know. 
He got Metroided. Oh. Got oh, Metroided. Yeah. Did you guys see how they, like, apparently somebody went to, like, the PlayStation logo from the PS1 and, like, turned the, the around? Flat, the flat PS1? Yeah. I hate and it they so found much. out the lo the logo is actually a m like two models and shit. <laughs> it's the worst, and I hate it.